Well, this looks promising. Look at the Scooby-Doo van. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that's what I was thinking? You know, these types of houses remind me of what America was doing in the 50s. You know, this is Scotland's answer to an American sprawl, and yet it makes me want to go surfing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a home that looks like every other on the street, but I think it's going to be quite different inside. Oh, goody. Shall we have a look? Yeah. Seventies heaven. We've got the both lens from the glass. Look. That's lovely, isn't it? Open stair. All this stuff just takes me right back to my youth. <laughs> I remember all this stuff so well. Do you know the texture of that kind of the dark wood? That pattern of the parquet flooring? Mm -hmm. All this stuff is so resonant of that era, isn't it? Yeah, the flooring is great and this colour green. I can't believe we've just taken it all the way up the stairs. They've really gone for it. It's very much like stepping back in time, isn't it? This home feels like it's always looked like this but maybe it's been restored to look like this again. <laughs> well, I feel quite at home in this room. It's like red and yellow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the sign. Be excellent to each other. Oh, that's well, nice. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> I love this wallpaper. It sort of looks like um, the Formica that you would get in an old caravan or a greasy spoon tabletop. Love the tiles. So we've gone from turquoise to apricot. Mm -hmm. This is a little bit more muted. I love these worktops. They're old science lab worktops from schools. I'm feeling nervous. <laughs> I haven't done, done my homework. Were well, you not very good at science? I was rubbish at science chemistry. I was so bad at it. But I've put these in a kitchen before. I mean, it's really beautiful quality wood, and that's going to last as long as you'd ever need it to. And the heart, just where you'd expect it to be, right underneath the glitter ball. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've clearly come right through the home. We're into a new bit. You know, the proportions have changed. You can see the knock through there. We've got a jungle in here. That's absolutely incredible, that mural on the kitchen units. These cupboards, because they're so out there, it kind of defines the space, and it makes you forget that you're even in the kitchen at all. So it makes this room feel like a dining room, then, doesn't it? Because the kitchen units, which are a kind of functional, boring thing, they're turned into a, like an art feature. I mean, what a beautiful space to have. Well, such a classic 70s thing to do. Build an extension. <laughs> <laughs> a boat in the middle of a forest. Yeah, I think that's fair enough, don't you? Oh, look, there's a sign here. Here be treasure. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should try and find yeah. the treasure, right? <laughs> you manage. Yeah, yep, I think I can cope. The little lady's strong enough. Uh, she says, Ooh, there we go. Oh! oh. <laughs> look there's at the beach. beach. Oh, OK. All right, me hearties. Uh, <laughs> would you like a rum? <laughs> I know Tiki Bar would be complete without the creature from the Black Lagoon. <laughs> <laughs> and what a wonderful reward for our intrepid journey through the jungle to our own little Tiki Bar with drinks waiting for us. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Everywhere was very fun. It was a joy to be in this home because it was very clear that they had this theme in mind and the style and just ran with it, which I think is very charming, I think, to have such a homely home that was filled with all these beautiful retro pieces. It's just an absolute wonderland of colour and just brilliant pieces of furniture, things that have been made, things that have been salvaged, vintage pieces. It was just paradise for me. I love the imagination and the ingenuity and the joy that has been brought into this home. This just feels like a really fun place to live. This home is obviously just taking me back to my youth and it's impossible not just to love it, just because I get that empathy and sympathy with that era. What I so admire about this home, however, is it's not just a homage to the 70s. The homeowner has brought a sort of unique flavor, that Americana. All that stuff we saw on the telly in the 70s has come out of the TV and went onto the walls and into the decor. Mm -hmm.